Hi everyone, in this video I am going to explain how to predict Bitcoin price using deep learning. We will be using RNN Long Short Term Memory Network, which is a recurrent neural network, to predict the Bitcoin price. So let's get started. My name is Kate, an assistant of Suraj. And if you are new to my channel, please hit subscribe to get notified for more awesome videos. Not too long ago, we used machine learning models to predict the future prices of Bitcoin. But, what if there was another way, besides machine learning to forecast time series data? The answer to that question is Deep learning. Deep learning is a subset of machine learning, but the key difference between the two is that deep learning uses neural networks which grants the machine the ability to train itself. Deep learning is capable of doing all the tweaking and fixing by itself, without the need of any hands-on interference by the user or engineer. A recurrent neural network have ability to memorize previous input in a memory when a huge set of sequential data is given. Here you can see that second input is dependent on first output. In the same way third input depend on second and first input. The problem with this RNN is long-term dependency, as it works on backpropagation algorithm. So in big neural network we face with vanishing gradient and exploding gradient. So to overcome this problem, we have come up with another special type of RNN, called Long Short-Term Memory Network. LSTM are designed to avoid long-term dependency problem. So let us start predicting Bitcoin price using deep learning. All the files will be available in my GitHub channel, link will be in the description. First, we need to install the necessary libraries, in order to create our neural network. Next, we load in the CSV file, containing Bitcoin's historical price data, which we can download from Yahoo Finance. The link is given in the description, so you can download it from there. Before downloading you need to set time period. I have selected max. What we are going to do, is we are going to divide data into training data and test data. So till December 2019 will be our training data. And from Jan 2020 will be our testing data. Now we are going to drop some column which we don't need like date. We will scale the data using Scikit Learn's min max scaler. By default min max scalar is set to minimum value 0 and maximum value 1. For training we will create a data set of 60 days. Now we are going to build our LSTM. We are going to add LSTM and pass units as 50 and activation function as relu. In the same way we will add few more layers. You can set value as you need, you can adjust values to get more accurate result. We use optimizer as Adam optimizer and loss function as mean absolute error. You can also use loss function as mean squared error. The reason behind choosing mean absolute error over root mean squared error is that mean absolute error is more interpretable. You can see the graph. That mean absolute error is more accurate. I used 20 epochs and batch size 50, you can adjust it to get low loss. Lower the loss higher will be the accuracy. Now we are going to create test data. Finally we are going to predict the price. Because we have used min max scalar, the values are scaled down. So we need to get it back to normal by reverting it. By reverting means we are going to multiply it with a scale value. Now we are going to visualize it. So this is the final output. You can change some values in epochs and batch size to get better accuracy. So this is how you can predict Bitcoin price using deep learning. The code will be available on my GitHub page. If you like my video please hit subscribe. Thank you for watching, and see you again in the next video.